What's up YouTube, it's your boy Matrix21 back with yet another video and today we're going to talk about the Elmo on trike. Get this bad boy out of the box, review it, so let's go. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell as well so you never miss a video. And if you're a returning viewer, thanks for stopping by, hit that like button, now let's get to the pops. So like I said, today we're going to talk about the, the Target Con 2024 exclusive flock version of Elmo. Uh, it is a really cool pop. The box, as you've heard many, many times, you should hear again in this video, the box is well oversized for this pop. Even though it's a dope pop, and I'm glad they actually did this little background in the back as well to add a little bit extra to it because the price is 30 bucks instead of 15. <laughs> but it is what it is. Uh, like I said, it's still a really cool pop. Uh, top's open a little bit, but it's dope. It's dope. Even though I don't collect Sesame Street Pops, but this is one that I didn't want to pass on. Uh, didn't notice that mine got cut right across the top. Didn't notice that when I picked it up, but it is what it is. It's still a cool pop. Glad to have it in the collection. Um, and when we get it out of the box, you'll see just how cool this is, how well made this pop is. But, but let's talk about the box on it, and the box looks pretty cool. Vibrant colors. I love the way they did him right here on the trike. Uh, just really vibrant out there kind of colors kind of reminiscent of uh, elmo and sesame street and they did a really good job with this one uh, actually in the bottom sesame street sesame street workshop and uh it's really cool really cool just like i said the only thing you can complain about is the size of the box and the price because of the size of the box other than that this pop is on point it's nice it's cool but we gotta get this bad boy out of the box so let's do that get it out of the box review it and i'll be right back So before we get it out of completely out of the box, let's look at it in the plastic. And this is <laughs> absolutely ridiculous, man. This much plastic for this small Funko Pop. Like I said, this definitely fits into a regular size box easily. And they could have did a, a blister pack that was a lot smaller than this. But like I said, they decided to go this route to charge double the price. So that's just one of the things that come with Funko that I don't like, but they could have did it different with, differently with this. Like I said, all this excess plastic for what reason? It's unnecessary, but it is what it is. So let's get this bad boy out of the plastic and review it. So here it is out of the plastic. And like I said, this definitely is a really cool, really nice looking pop. The, the colors are on point. The flocking is on point. They did a really good job with it. It's a little weird scene right here where his nose meets his eyes. But other than that, this thing is pretty cool, man. The tricycle is okay. Uh, paint job on it is pretty cool. I think this is a sticker. No, that's actual paint. But uh, other than that, it's dope. The helmet is okay as well. Kids definitely wear your helmets. And uh, like I said, the flocking is dope. The actual coloring is dope. Very vibrant, very nicely painted. And uh, I like it. I like it a lot. Like I said, it, it's a really cool pop. Doesn't fit my collection at all, but I just can pass on this bad boy. You know what I mean? So uh, I think definitely if you're a fan of Sesame Street, try to pick this bad boy up. Or if you're just like Elmo, pick this bad boy up. Uh, so, you know. But like I said, as far as paint goes, uh, it looks pretty good. No paint flaws. The flocking is on point. The um, actual figure on, is on point as well. It's a small, not, I mean, as far as pop rides go, it's small, but as far as regular pops, it's a right, normal size pop. Uh, let me see if I have a pop as this in hand somewhere. The, let's compare size to the Ted pop. And like I said, same size pop, pretty much. So if you're looking for it out of box, I say you can really, you can fit, put this pop in any other places. In that box, the box is a little bit bigger, but uh, you'll find somewhere to put it. I like this pop a lot, so I'm just glad to add it to my collection. I don't know, it's still to be seen if it's gonna stay in my collection, I'm not sure yet. But as of right now, it is, and I like it. So let's get this bad boy in a rotator, give it a spin, and I'll come back and end the video. Let's go. Perfect. Perfect. So once again, this is my review for the Flock Target Con exclusive Elmo on trike. Definitely a really cool pop. Like I said, I like the way it looks. The everything's on point with this bad boy. Only difference, the only problem is they charge thirty dollars for it instead of the fifteen that it should have been. But you know, can't complain. You can just either buy it or don't buy it. You know, I bought it, so it is what it is. Can't complain about it. But let me know in the comments if you pick this bad boy up or will you be picking it up in the future. And let me know what you think about this long term. Do you think this will gain value or will you think it will stay where it is? But that's all I have for you on this one. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell as well so you never miss a video. This is your boy Major21. Peace. Talk to you all later. Bye.
Perfect. Perfect.